Apex Sporting Goods says it's taking a strong stand on gun control. As of today, it will no longer sell assault-style rifles and high-capacity magazines, and you now have to be at least 21 years old to buy a gun in one of its stores. WBZ's Christina Hager is live in Natick tonight with more on this. Christina? Well, David, this announcement, of course, a response to the Parkland, Florida school shooting. And it turns out that gunman had purchased a weapon at Dick's, not the weapon that he used in that shooting. But that's what prompted this change. We put our money where our mouth is. Dick's Sporting Goods in Natick. It's been a decade since this shopper has been here. So why did you make the decision to come here? Because I heard of what they did this morning on uh, gun control, and I appreciate it. No more selling so-called assault-style weapons that were still on the shelves at Dick's Field and Stream chain, none of which are in Massachusetts. Dix does sell other types of guns in the Bay State. The company's CEO, Ed Stack, says right from now on right. across the board, they'll limit gun sales to only customers 21 and older. We know there's going to be some backlash, but as we sat and talked about it with our management team, and we, we started talking about this with our management team, it was to a person that this is what we need to do. We need to take a stand on this. Dix has always shown this weakness. Jim Wallace heads up the Massachusetts Gun Owners Action League. It's kind of cowardly and very divisive because we're not talking about the issues that need to be discussed, which in Parkland, uh, like Newtown, like Aurora, was severe mental health issues that simply aren't being addressed. But at this store, a round of support from customers we spoke with. I'm thrilled. I'm proud. My hat's off to them. I think that more and more companies, if it hits them in their pocketbooks, if they feel it from the money end of it, the more will be done, and maybe the NRA will put some more restrictions in. Dick CEO said the Parkland shooting left executives with a pit in their stomachs, causing him to say enough is enough. And as you heard there, no argument from customers here today. In Natick, Christina Hager, WBZ News. Christina, thank you. A new